Bloody handprints? Freaky hot dog fingers? A nail in your hand? It's not horror movie scenes, but our new Halloween pranks. Watch it, have fun, and shock your friends. Before pranking friends, I should turn into a vampire. I need DIY teeth. Spread fatty cream over a piece of foil. Squeeze hot glue to shape long drops. They'll be fangs. Spread hot glue over another piece of foil. When the fangs harden, take them off the foil. Attach to the hot glue base. Remove the teeth. Put them on to become a vampire. My incredible look could be the envy of Count Dracula. Hold on, girls! The newly emerged vampire is going to make a lot of trouble. I hope I don't have to bite anybody with these fake teeth. There are lots of terribly awesome ideas you can find on our new channel, Troom Troom Select. Subscribe, follow the link below. I'm going to prank my two besties with a spider lollipop. Put a few pieces of chocolate into a Ziploc bag. Melt in hot water. Snip off a corner. Squeeze the chocolate to draw spiders. When cool, put on the wrapper. Put the lollipop in my friend's backpack. A spooky gift! The other bestie takes it out and pulls the wrapper off. What is on the candy? Ugh! Muck! Is it your way to prank me? Make another creepy candy. Treat your friend with an eyeball. Pull off the wrapper from a ball-shaped candy. Put it on a gummy eyeball. Place it in a box with other candies. What a wonderful day! Make it better with a candy. Oh, poor girl! She's nearly dropped my little gift. I think she doesn't like being watched. Where did you get this eerie hot dog? Have you been to a horror movie filming? Cut out a bun. Cut off a small layer of the hot dog at the tip to imitate a fingernail. Make three small cuts below the fingernail where the knuckle would be. Pour ketchup in the bun and place the fingers in it. Is it handmade stuff or one made with a part of a hand? Anyway, you'll hardly like to eat these bloody severed fingers, though you're well aware they are just Halloween hot dogs. What a cute little creature! I wish I could eat it, but I let it scare my friend instead. We'll need red liquid soap and a rubber centipede. Take off the dispenser and put in the bug. Shut the bottle. Ugh! The centipede in blood red liquid looks spooky. My friend is going to wash her face. She reaches out for the soap, but immediately pulls back her hand. She's been half asleep, but the disgusting insect makes her wake up at once. Ghastly! Halloween is the time for bloody pranks. Add red acrylic paint into white glue. Mix it. Apply the red glue on your palm. Make a handprint on baking paper. Define it with red glue. When dry, take it off carefully. Let's check how it works. Once upon a dark night, a girl entered a bathroom. Suddenly, the light began blinking. The mirror fogged and a bloody handprint appeared. Oh my! Help! Let me out! Let's go and check who's there hiding in the bathroom. It seems there's no one. It's only something wrong with the towel. Take a used bath towel you can throw away later. No, you won't need a knife. It's just paint. Squeeze red paint on your palm. Spread it over. Make your bloody handprints on the towel. Add a few dramatic stains on the sides. Hang it on the towel rack and watch your friend's scared reaction. 
Hope they won't scream out loud. The traces lead to the sofa. Look, there's something on it. We'll need an egg toy, a rubber eyeball, and red liquid slime. Put the slime in the egg and place the eyeball on top. Okay, let's open it. Oh, it's an eye. Ugh, ghastly. It's looking at us. And this bloody handprint again? What bad luck. How can she sleep on this terrible night? Especially when weird things happen. Cut a long nail in half using pliers. Apply hot glue on foil smudged with fatty cream. Stick the nail in the glue pool and wait until cool. Paint the hardened glue with blood red nail polish. Tear off the fake blood pool from the foil. While your friend's asleep, attach both nail parts to her hand. Oh my god! What's happened? Wait, it's not real blood. Unlike my revenge. I come up to my friend to ask her what it means, but she begins to take pictures of my hand, and I think she's right. The photos will be totally awesome. Mmm, it's a plate full of worms and a caterpillar on top. It's a great dish to share with my friend. The secret of the dish is in special water to cook pasta. Mix salt and oil. Add black food coloring and pour in some water. Boil it to cook the pasta. We've got a totally black dish. Take a rubber caterpillar. Make a cut on its belly to remove the filling. Inject mayonnaise inside using a syringe. Here's your Halloween pasta. Squeeze the caterpillar to leave a white trace. My friend doesn't look hungry. What's wrong? Don't you want to try this eerie stuff? Okay, I'll eat it myself and I really enjoy it. I've got tasty cookies with cute embellishments. As my friend hates spiders, I've made this dessert especially for her. Melt the chocolate in the same way you did for the lollipop. Outline spiders. Surprise! Oh no, she doesn't like spiders. Unlike me, I enjoy tasty cookies with these pretty chocolate creatures. I keep crunching so temptingly, she overcomes her arachnophobia. Mmm, tasty. If my friend is so crazy about spiders, I'll add a few fake ones to her dessert. They look exactly like the real ones. My friends left her spooky cookies on the table. I add a few rubber spiders to increase the effect. She's going to take a picture of her sweet masterpiece and put the picture on Instagram. Oops! The chocolate spiders seem to have invited their rubber brothers. Ugh! Dislike! Do you like soft marshmallows? It's pure white and no one can suspect there's something inside. Separate a marshmallow into two halves. Cut out the middle part. Put in a gummy brain. Add a little raspberry syrup using a syringe. Cover it with the other half. Your friend bites the marshmallow. Oh, sweetheart! There's a brain inside. Who's lost it, I wonder? And where is its owner? What a lovely snake. It's perfect for my Halloween punch. Put the most scary gummies into a big bowl. Take eyeballs, spiders, and a snake. Pour in red syrup. Add some water. Mix it. Mmm, delicious! Treat your friend with the punch. It matches her spider cookies. Which ingredient does she like the most, I wonder? Is it a gummy snake, eyeballs, or spiders? She seems to enjoy the punch anyway. I prank my friend with blood red syrup in big syringes. While she's drinking her punch, I take out a scary syringe and eject dark red liquid into a glass. Let her think it's blood. Oh my! I've never supposed my friend so bloodthirsty. I think I shouldn't prank her anymore. I'm afraid she may turn into a vampire. Are you scared? You shouldn't be. It's just fruit syrup. It's the right time to play tricks on your friends. Which Halloween pranks have you chosen? Write in your comments what impressed your friends the most. 
Hit the like button, subscribe to our channel, and click the bell. There's a lot of interesting DIYs waiting for you on our channel. Have you taken your makeup bag instead of your pencil case to school again? No wonder! It's easy to mix up stuff. Watch our new video to put everything in its place. Transform an eyeshadow palette into a notepad. Is it magic? No, it's just a new weird school supply idea. Measure out an empty palette. Mark pages of the appropriate size on white paper. Cut out as many pages as you need. Mark the notepad size on black self-adhesive paper. Leave a strip across the length to secure the pages. Cut it out and attach to the top page. Fold the strip to fasten the notes. Place the notepad in the palette. Attach color squares onto the black background to imitate the eyeshadow. Add a pencil and an eraser instead of an applicator. This notepad, disguised as eyeshadow, will let you feel like a spy making secret notes. Give it to your friend and watch how fast she will guess this is not makeup. Can you draw with your EOS Balm on the ground? Yes, you can! Great chalk! Mix colors until you're satisfied with the shade. Add rubbing alcohol and stir well. Take apart an EOS container. Put the middle part on the top. Transfer the wet chalk into it. Place a napkin on top and press it over to get the excess moisture out and turn the chalk solid. Pop up the container. Let it dry. You've got a soft lavender EOS chalk. Don't let your friend apply it on her lips. It's for the ground. Draw anything you like and keep your hands clean. Is there a secret hidden inside this nail polish? Look under the top to know what it is. We'll need an empty nail polish bottle. Remove everything from the top. Cut out a ballpoint pen refill of the appropriate size. Pour hot glue into a nib and put in the refill. Apply hot glue onto the bottleneck edge and assemble the pen. Put on the top. No one will guess there's a pen inside the bottle. Your friend will be astonished when you start writing with it. She checks if there's a wonderful pen somewhere else under the nail polish top. Find the most amazing DIY ideas on our new channel, Troom Troom Select. Be sure to subscribe, see the link below. Do you need a marker? No problem! Take a makeup brush as a bonus. Separate the metal part with the bristles from the handle. Hot glue a marker to the metal part. We've got a brush on one side and a marker on the other. Your friend needs a marker. Give her your magic brush. She's astonished as she asked for a marker. Let her choose what to do, whether she wants to highlight her writings or her cheekbones. Is your friend going to take your mascara again? She won't be able to apply it on her lashes this time. Snip off the clip from a marker cap. Take a foam rubber sheet of the appropriate color and size. Hot glue to the cap. Cut off the excess. Press the cap against the foam rubber sheet and cut out the top. Attach it to the cap. Trim it to fit the size. Cover the barrel with the foam rubber. Keep in mind the cap. Repeat the regular mascara pattern on the fake one. Your friend is frustrated. She wanted to put on mascara, but there's a marker instead. 
I like to draw with my fake mascara in my notebook. Do you always keep two things on hand? A lipstick and a flash drive? We'll show you a way to join them. Remove the printed circuit board from the plastic casing. Take an empty lipstick container. Join your flash drive with the tube. At last they've met. I think it's love. The flash drive perfectly fits the lipstick tube. My friend can't get why the heck I took my lipstick while working on the laptop. It's okay. I'm not going to put on lipstick right now. There's a memory stick inside. I've got an amazing lipstick idea as well. Cut off the excess from a refill. Take an empty lipstick tube and attach the shortened pen into it. Apply hot glue onto the nib and sprinkle with glitter. What a lovely little pen! Your friend doesn't expect to see a pen instead of a lipstick. But she quickly gets used to writing with this convenient pen. Have you made a mistake? No problem! We'll correct it with eyeliner immediately. What? We need an empty eyeliner bottle. Pour in correction fluid. White eyeliner? Is it a new brand? No, it's my correction fluid. Quite practical, I should say. Correct your mistake in style with a thin eyeliner brush. Are you going to apply tint on your lips or draw with a pencil? Take an empty tint tube. Remove the dispenser. Snip off the top. Set it back. Cut a pencil of the fitting size. Put it in the tube. Is it a pencil or tint? Let's see my friend's reaction. She doesn't look bewildered. It seems my pranks have made her insensitive to weird things. She doesn't react as vigorously as she used to. Isn't there a tint inside? Okay, let it be a pencil. I can draw it instead of doing my makeup. What should you use to erase a pencil? Use eyeshadow. Take a bright square eraser. Mark its size on black cardboard. Cut out a strip. Wrap it around the eraser. Snip off the excess. Cut out a little window. Put on the black wrapping and hot glue the edges. Write a makeup brand logo in the window. My friend is astonished to see me erasing a pencil with the eyeshadow. Do you like to use glitter for your makeup? Use it in your painting as well. Remove the dispenser from an empty lip gloss container. We'll use it to keep acrylic paints in it. You can put in a pure color. Or mix a few paints. Add some glitter. Your friend paints with an art brush. Amaze her using your new glosses. An applicator works as well as a brush. Besides, it doesn't need washing and drying. Put your modeling clay into a makeup jar to prevent it sticking to everything in your backpack. Cut the clay sticks to fit the jar. Put them in. Embellish the top. Cut out a circle of the appropriate size from self-adhesive paper and stick it onto the top. Is it your new cream? No, it's not. It's my modeling clay. Let's create 3D beauty. We've transformed a makeup pencil into something else. Be careful. Put a fitting ballpoint pen refill into a used retractable eye pencil. Give it to your friend to apply eyeliner. She doesn't suspect anything and begins lining her eyelid. Oh my! It's a pen! It's your pranks again! Is it a lipstick? No, it's a wax stick. It's another smart idea of weird stationery. Break a piece of a wax crayon. Remove the wrapper. Melt it above the flame and stick it into the lipstick tube. Take your bright lipstick and draw in your notebook. Your friend will certainly like it. Is it an erasing lipstick? It's another way to give your used lipstick container a second life. Take an empty lipstick container and a carrot pink eraser. Cut off the excess. 
Pair the eraser to fit the tube. Wow! You've got a new lipstick! Strange! It smells of rubber! Oh! It's an eraser! I've got the same! We showed how to make it in our previous prank video! Now your pencil case is full of new makeup ideas! Make weird school supplies together with your friends! Write in your comments which idea you liked the most! Give your thumbs up and be sure to subscribe to the Troom Troom channel! Click the bell and amaze your friends with weird ideas!